Some brakes, wheel hub, rotors, exhaust wing, brakes. Smaller pulley, right? Yep. It's a lot different. Where are you at? The little shop. <laughs> That's a cop. Rev, rev, rev. Still waiting. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. What, what? Well, no, we can actually fit them all in if I take my crap out. What are you doing? Put pizza in the vet, though. <laughs> <laughs> This car is a blast. I love, love this car. But today, today's video is not only going to be about a Corvette. Actually, primarily, it's going to be about a GT500, a GT350R, and something special at the end. We're making two pit stops, two trips today. We got to put the brake in mileage on the C8 so that we can do a first drive and go wide open throttle. But I don't want to leave out my Mustang guys, so this video is for you. Anybody that hates on the C8 Corvette, you're wrong. You either haven't driven one, haven't been around them, you can't not, not like it, in my opinion. As an enthusiast, this is a channel for everybody. Well, we have the, the two cars together that are being directly compared for whatever reason on the internet. The uh, C8 Corvette and the new 2020 Shelby 500. C8, 2020 Shelby. Since we've seen this last, uh, I believe he's done like a pulley, some other mods, definitely not the same. That's the other reason I got the stripes from the factory into the aftermarket because if you look closely, the stripes do go across the spoiler. Oh, okay. So it was a hundred bucks to get that black and the mirrors black. Oh, really? The, the reason I can't own a Corvette is because it'd have to be, yeah, it'd have to be like everything, Alcantara, everything. Because they are so nice. And yeah, it, it is, honestly. All right, now oh my here's God, what's I'm cool. on the floor. Yeah. yeah. Here's what's cool, close <laughs> the door and watch the dash. <laughs> <laughs> he likes it. <laughs> yes, he does. You can't replace that smile. You no. can't fake it. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Grab the handle like you are, right at your thumb. And kick it out. <laughs> cool, man. Dude, this thing is so nice. So what did you do to this thing, man? You were I saw your video. You were uh, uh, yeah. changing some stuff. I see the wheels. I'll pop the hood, yeah. I just put these on messing around. Yeah. <laughs> no, he he asked me the other day. Hey, do you want to drive it? And I was like, not till that braking is done. Yeah. So right. you got the JLT now. You went to a different, a smaller pulley, right? Yep. So it's a 2.8 SPE pulley, titanium gotcha. hub, and all that stuff. JLT intake. We did the Whipple intercooler. Okay. Uh, we also did a 180 thermostat to try to keep it you know, a, little a little bit cooler. Yeah, a little cooler. And then cat deletes and tune from Palm Beach Dino. Should it's make freaking nasty. Oh, I bet. <laughs> I, I mean, I remember how nasty it was when we were in the car before. I can only imagine now. Dual clutch transmission in his new 2020 Shelby 500 and also a DCT in that guy back there. I didn't want to drive it yet until the break-in miles are done complete on his new Corvette. I want the full experience so we can showcase it to you watching these videos. But, I mean, so cool that we get to hang out with such beautiful, awesome, high-performance machines such as the 500, which we've been on track with and I have a lot of seat time myself driving one. Also, real quick, update on my twin turbo Mustang. What is the status? Because a lot of you guys have been commenting, where is the Mustang? Well, we showed it in the garage. The transmission, we have to get rebuilt. The mishap that we had on track chasing our eight second quarter mile pass. We will get there, video coming soon. Yeah, you gotta pay to play, unfortunately. It's, uh, it's one of the, the thrills and also some of the trouble that we have to deal with. We're making YouTube content for you guys, but I mean, look at this thing. This thing is torn apart. It's crazy. Guarded race car. But he robbed all the suspension and put it on the 500. Pretty crazy. Some brakes, wheel hub, rotors, exhaust wing, brakes, carbon fiber wheels. Well, we're gonna make another three hour trip to go visit another friend of mine, Speed Addict 731. Ken, you guys know him. He's been on my channel so many times. Hopefully you're having a good day. Hopefully you're having fun watching. Give it a thumbs up to the video. Again, subscribe if you are new. What'd you think? How do you like it compared to your 500? To be honest, 
honest with you. You know, I've always say all the time that I'm a diehard Mustang guy, but I don't BS. You know what I mean? Like when it exactly. comes to interior quality and aesthetics and things like that, I mean, this is a superior car. It, it is 100%. So that's where the money's going. So you got a lot of performance over here, but and this is kind of like this is perform. Yeah, exactly. When you sit inside these, you understand like. People hate on this car, and I don't get it. I don't understand why. It's like a video game. Right. It's, yeah. I mean, just everything about it is is way higher quality, and that's where you're spending, you know, on like the luxury. DLT, you could spend ninety grand, and that car is ninety grand. But the difference is, is the quality of the build and the this, interior quality. And... Exactly. This was not supposed to be this. Not at all. That's its own thing. Yeah. This has got more luxury, creature comforts, hot and cooled seats, everything. This is what you would take on a racetrack. More of a driver's car where that's more like brute force. Exactly. I agree with that 100%. Yeah, all day long. I think if you were to compare, even though they're different classes of cars. Yeah. If you were to compare this to a Shelby, it's the GT350. They're both 3,600 pounds. They're both right. two-seaters. They're both almost 500 horsepower, or right at 500. Yeah. A little more for the 350, a little under for this. Yeah, I like it. A lot different. Are those just the candelites? Yeah, That's I, it? I even added resonators. Holy crap, dude. Yeah, that's a hell of a difference, man. Got the cage in there. I couldn't believe how loud it was even after I put resonators. That's crazy. I bought the lethal catalytes. Don't take off the flex section parts and I added resonators there. Yeah. Yeah, don't take that to California anytime soon. <laughs> <laughs> You, you go into the little shop? Yeah, the little shop. Right? Well, well, hell. All right, I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> There's an old classic right there, man. We're riding in the new hotness, but how cool to pass by a rolling piece of history. And I hate give a thumbs up. Yes, he did. <laughs> That's a cop. What's up? What's going on, man? What are you doing? <laughs> Do you need me to park somewhere else? No, you're, no, you're good. good. You're good right there. You're good. Oh my goodness, we're finally here. Hold on, man. Guys, look who just showed up. I just I just yeah, stole you've it. You've been clickbaiting everybody, man. What's oh. up with that? <laughs> he was a Mustang owner. People hated I'm on that video. He was a Mustang owner. Yes, and we he traded for this. Guys, this is Jeremy. He's wow, look how green it looks right now. And this is the color that it is. Finally the like the color's coming correctly off on camera. Beautiful. Then we got Ken. Hellhorse twin turbo kit, same as mine. And he's working on something inside. We're gonna check it out. Man, this thing is sharp. It is. This is the first time he's seeing one this close to person. Oh yeah, you gotta sit. Yeah, sit in that thing, man. It's crazy. No, this is yeah, this is a custom custom order. Fifteen months ago he ordered this thing. Traded in a uh, 2018 Mustang and uh, yeah, evolved to this. Hey, you know, I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't a fan at first, but they actually do look good. I mean, yeah, it's it's like um, it's completely different than what you would expect to see compared to a picture to this. And personally, it looks good. I'm a diehard Mustang guy. Ken's a diehard Mustang guy. He was. You're a Mustang fan. Yeah. I mean, you can't not appreciate it. You know what I mean? People hate on this car because I see it in the comments too, and they're like, "Oh, it's a Corvette. It's this. It's that. It's whatever." But it's a beautiful car. That's all I want to see right there. Yeah, the engine, the LT2. Four hundred ninety-five horsepower. It needs twin turbos sitting up here. It really does. 
agree. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. He's got. Hey, we're ripping your twins off, Ken. Huh? We're ripping your twins off. It's going over here. We're gonna put them up here. If he pays for it, I'll do it right now. <laughs> Speed Addict Seven Three One. If you're new to the channel, the guy in the blue. He's like my my mechanic. Yeah, I love this dude. Yeah, this Honestly, man. The guy's a saint. He really is. He's one of my favorite people in the whole world. I'm late to the, I'm but late to what is he doing in here? What is he working on? So we're getting a sneak peek. It's something he's doing. What is he doing? Got a Mustang ripped apart. Hey, Kim, what are you doing here? Huh? What are you doing to this thing? Where's it at? Oh, you got it? Yeah, let's check it out. I've got, I've kind of got everything tucked away. Grab that bumper. Yeah, you're alright. Grab that bumper. I kind of got everything tucked away, get it out of the way when I'm not here. And just kind of easily put it on things and it's going to make things really easy. Velocity blue. The last kit I did was the black. Pro yeah. Charger. It's the same pro charger. It's a stage Ooh, two kit. Look at there. Except it's just a, I actually like the finish on it. I, I like the just a natural. Oh, that thing is huge, dude. Yeah. Look at that. Oh. I mean, yeah, it's big. And it's about eight and a half pounds with the pulley that comes with it from pro charger. Oh, uh, okay. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. We could, we're putting oil pump gears so, in it right now. Baby boost is yeah. what that is. It's a 19. It's a 19 Velocity Blue performance pack. Fully love it. 2019 Ford Mustang GT 10 R80? 10 R80. 10 R80. Pro charged. Check out Speed Addict 731. Mm -hmm. He's going to have a video, dyno video of a pro charged. What, what model is this again? This is, the, this is the P1X. P1X. P1X pro charger on this car. Yeah, we do have our twin turbo. Mine's ten broken. Four, mine's broken. 10 4 on 7 pounds of boost. What now? I said 10 4 on 7 pounds. The oh, car. Okay. What mine did. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. What, what? I spoiled you. Twin, ten, I, ten four. Ten four. Quarter mile. Oh my gosh. Where, where are you at, Xander? I don't know. I was oh, talking about start... Dino when you started talking about ten four. I'm like, ten four what? What do you mean? No, I'm talking about my car. It's twin turbo. But uh, yeah, the last, the last, uh, the, the, uh, the gray car that I had that was a 19 also. Yeah. It put down 600 to the wheel with the same Pro Charter kit. So we're gonna take this one up there. This is a performance pack, so it should be right there around the same numbers. Uh, 93 octane, uh, eight and a half pounds of boost. So. Eight and a half pounds, Pro Charger. He's doing OPG CS right now in the middle of that. Um, by the way, guys, videos on my channel, but a lot of them on yours mm -hmm. on how to do a lot of this hands-on stuff. So definitely, definitely check out those videos. C8 kind of got my attention I know the C8. I is, the C8 is, is sexy, man. It really is. Three, one. We're just going to hang out. It's a bro time. Hang out with the cars. Don't really know if we're going to continue this video. I guess if we do, then it won't end now. But if it does, thank you so much for watching. Glad to have you on the channel. If you're new, subscribe. Appreciate it. Hit the thumbs up button or thumbs down. However, you woke up this morning and you are feeling, guys, what a great time to be alive, enjoying cars like this. Really appreciate all of you out there watching, helping us grow. I will see you in the next video, unless this one's not over. So just keep watching. But if it is, I'll see you later. Hey, how about this? The passenger side, memory seating on the passenger and lumbar support and the side bolsters also come in and out on the passenger. Yeah, normally the passenger gets nothing. It's really cool, man. Rev! Rev! Yes, 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 Rev. Revs! Still waiting. It takes forever. It needs more loud. I mean, love Mustangs, but I appreciate everything, honestly, you know? I do too, and that's one thing, that's a lot of technology. You gotta give GM one thing, that is a lot. You gotta of give them credit. They did, they, it's, it's it, okay, it's a bow tie car, but they did a good job. This MSRP, the window sticker is under 80,000. I don't know, I don't, I've yet to look at GT500 prices. Probably to get one with the same equipment as the GT500, like, like with all it, the different. Uh, it's about the same money, yeah. Is it about the same money? Yeah. But you're getting a lot more tech and all that. Of course, the 500's got more power. Oh, yeah, I mean. But they're yeah. honestly, people compare them by price point, and uh, you know it, they really shouldn't be because the Corvette is is just different. Ooh, that sounds it good. sounds good, don't it?
<laughs> the next one, I don't know. I haven't driven the car yet, so we have to do a driving review. And if you guys watch me, you know that I'm not going to be easy on the car. It's going to be a lot of fun. And I'm going to give you my honest, no BS review, which is going to be... It's interesting because a lot of YouTubers fluff stuff around. I'm going to give you my honest opinion. Honestly. It's going to be... It's going to be some fun. But we also have mods to put on this thing as soon as we get it back home it's exhaust related so we're gonna make it louder definitely stick around for those videos it'll be a lot of fun so all right that's it we're gonna officially end the video i think and i'll see you in the next one bye oh we lost voice on well no we can actually fit them all in if i take my crap out what are really? you doing Putting pizza in the bed, huh? <laughs> <laughs> what